Well, it looks like we're actually going to cool things down tomorrow. Thank goodness. We tied a record of 99 degrees this afternoon. We had some triple digits all across eastern Colorado. It was hot basically no matter where you went. So through the rest of tonight, we're cooling things off nicely. Once the sun goes down, we'll be in the 80s around 9 p.m., 77 by 11 p.m. with partly cloudy skies. But it will be a warm evening nonetheless. Now, it looks like this outside right now from the Denver Museum of Nature and Science. Cloudy skies. A few scattered showers have been trying to get going, but we haven't had any widespread rainfall here for our area. 99, that record today. Uh, we set that record last year on this day of 99 degrees. 101 for Greeley, 99 for Ray, and even 100 for Pueblo with upper 90s out toward Grand Junction and 80s in the mountains. As for our average afternoon high, we should be around 90. We, of course, tied that record set back in 2019 with overnight lows. They should be around 60 degrees, and that's where they'll be tonight. As for our satellite radar picture, you can see that we do have a few scattered showers through most of western and southern Colorado, a lot of lightning toward Alamosa. But here in Denver, not much has been happening in the way of rainfall. Now, off to the north near New Raymer, we have some lightning strikes and some heavier rain, but no watches or warnings with these storms moving through. Mostly cloudy skies tonight, 65 will be our overnight low, and we'll have those mid-60s here from Denver, out toward Ray, Akron, and Burlington mid to upper 60s for southeastern Colorado with 40s and 50s for the higher elevations. Those lows tonight here around the Denver Metro, 64 downtown, 60 in Castle Rock and 61 for Parker with 50s as you head off to the west for Blackhawk, Nederland and Idaho Springs, 59 degrees for you. Our out and about forecast looks pretty good tomorrow, cooler by about 10 degrees thanks to a cold front passing through in the next 12 hours, 83 degrees by noon, 89 by 2 o'clock, which will feel downright cool as compared to what we had today. 89 tomorrow for your barbecue forecast at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and then 81 by 7 o'clock. What we can bet on tomorrow is afternoon and evening thunderstorms. Those are going to be coming through the area tomorrow, and the best chance for severe weather is going to be off to our northeast around Sterling, Akron, and Burlington with heavy rain, lightning, and hail being a possibility tomorrow. So upper 80s here around Denver, up toward uh, Fort Collins and Greeley, and we'll also have low to mid 90s toward Pueblo, La Junta, and Lamar. 70s and 80s for the high country, but here in Denver, 90 degrees downtown, 89 at DIA, and those upper 80s and low 90s farther to our north. Now on the seven-day forecast, pretty consistent temperatures here on the seven-day. We haven't seen that in quite a while, but we'll hover right around 90 degrees as we go into the beginning of the week. Some scattered thunderstorms on Monday and then 92 on Wednesday, staying in the low 90s through the end of the week with those scattered showers and overnight lows mostly in the 60s. So we're back down toward normal territory versus record territory, which I think we can all be glad about.